Moving on to the ACCA eligibility criteria. What is the eligibility criteria? So many students have this query. Am I really eligible? Can I do ACCA? So here's the main eligibility criteria. Let me just break down to you. First, to be eligible to register for ACCA qualification, those students who have done their 10 plus 2 exams, that is who have cleared the 12th exams, and they have an aggregate of 65% in maths or accounts and English. So either you can choose one from maths or accounts, one and English if the aggregate is 65% and 50% minimum in all other subjects, then yes. You are eligible, you could straight away start your ACC. But let's assume you do not meet this criteria or you have just cleared, let's say, your class 10th, but you want to do ACCA, then you can still do so. That's not to worry. You can still do so by the FIA route, which is the foundation in accountancy route. Now, this is nothing different. Basically, the subjects that you have in your ACC knowledge level, right? there are three exams. The same papers are there in FIA route also. It's just a different name is given. There are some other papers also in FIA route, but those are all optional. These three are basically that you have to give. And these you would have essentially even which is given if you are doing just after your class 12th. So if you do not meet the first point, the first criteria, you do not have to worry. You can still do ACCA because you can follow the FIA route. So those students who are from, you know, let's say science background, they also sometimes want to come and do ACCA. So yes, you can do. It is very much possible. So, you know, one doesn't have to worry about that. Thank you.